so in this video we will be covering the most important questions for the pgd sma exam let's start looking at those questions pigeonhole problem pigeonhole problems meaning when you have to put certain number of items in certain number of boxes now this is a very classic problem and there are a lot of variations of this problem next would be transpose and inverse of matrices and different kinds of questions based on the properties of transpose and inverse of matrices then questions based on greatest integer function polynomials and when we look at coordinate geometry you have to look at the general equation of circle and conic sections because there will be a lot of straightforward questions from there you need to know a particular type of questions in which let's say you are trying to aim at a target and you have some probability of hitting the target so in 10 attempts what is the probability that you will be able to hit the attempt so in these kinds of questions you have to think of it in the opposite direction that what is the probability i will not be able to hit the target so 1 minus that probability will give you the answer so there could be a lot of questions based on variations of this then you can get questions based on values of function so f1 is this f2 is this and so on and so find this thing then you can get questions based on venn diagram and set theory then the classic maxima minima based problems will definitely come and divisibility is also important solving system of equations is important because generally you have to use some kind of a linear algebra there and then you also need to know the am gm hm inequality because using am gm hm inequality you can solve a lot of maxima minima questions now when we are talking about inequality you need to know the wavy curve method of solving few inequalities essentially when the expression will be positive and when it will be negative things like those then questions based on few manipulation of roots of quadratic equation then you definitely need to know the properties of probability what is mutually exclusive what is independent and things like those then there is a very common question type in all iisa exams which is coefficient of x to the power r in some expression of x then binomial expansion basics of complex numbers integral based area questions series summation bijective injective surjective functions and finally do not forget to look at the questions involving rank of matrices 